Stand back. On your ready. I want tasers on full charge. Block the opening. Don't let her get out. Somebody help her. Shoot her. Shoot her. I heard that Hammond's not even here. He sends his apologies. There's a $20 million lawsuit by the family of that worker. And you're telling me that Hammond can't see me? He had to leave early. His daughter's getting a divorce. I understand, but we need to deal with the situation now. The underwriters feel that the accidents raised safety questions about the park. That makes the investors very anxious. I had to promise to conduct a very thorough, on-site inspection or they'll pull the funding. If two experts sign off on the island, the insurance guys will back off. I've already got Ian Malcolm, but they think he's too trendy. They want Alan Grant. Grant? You'll never get him out of Montana. Why not? Because Grant's like me. He's a digger. Cover the site. Cover up the dig. Tell them to shut down. Shut it down. Who in God's name do you think you are? John Hammond. And I'm delighted to meet you finally in person, Dr. Grant. I like both of you. I own an island off the coast of Costa Rica. I've been setting up a biological preserve. Make the one I've got down in Kenya look like a petting zoo. But my investors want an opinion from an expert who will sign that the park is safe for visitors. What kind of park is this? It has to do with your expertise. Why don't you come down, just the pair of you, for the weekend? I'd love to have an opinion of a paleobotanist as well. So you two dig up dinosaurs? Well, we try to. You'll have to get used to Dr. Malcolm. He is a mathematician. Chaotician. Chaotician actually. Dr. Sattler, Dr. Grant, you've heard of chaos theory? Strange attractors? I refuse to believe that you aren't familiar with the concept of attraction. There it is. The full 50 miles of perimeter fence are in place. And the concrete moats, and the motion sensor tracking systems. Donald, dear boy, relax. Try and enjoy yourself. This is a serious investigation of the stability of the island. Your investors, whom I represent, are deeply concerned. All right, slow down. Stop. Alan, this species of veriformin has been extinct since the Cretaceous period. What? It's a dinosaur. You did it. We could tear up the rule book on cold blood if it's... It doesn't apply. They're wrong. This is a warm-blooded creature. This thing doesn't live in a swamp. This thing's got a 25, 27-foot neck. The Brachiosaurus? 30. We're gonna make a fortune with this place. How fast are they? We clocked the T-Rex at 32 miles an hour. T-Rex? You said you've got a T-Rex? Say again. We have a T-Rex. Dr. Grant, my dear Dr. Sattler, welcome to Jurassic Park. They're moving in herds. They do move in herds. How did you do this? I'll show you. The most advanced amusement park in the entire world, incorporating all the latest technologies. Perfect timing. They are about to hatch. I've been present for the birth of every little creature on this island. 
surely not the ones that have bred in the wild? Actually they can't breed in the wild. Population control is one of our security precautions. We control their chromosomes. It's really not that difficult. Grandpa. Kids. We miss you. Me too. You'll take a tour of the park with my grandchildren while I watch it from the control room. Dr. Grant, I read your book. That's great. National Weather Service is tracking a tropical storm about 75 miles west of us. Why didn't I build in Orlando? I'll keep an eye on it. Maybe it'll swing south like the last one. Ray, start the tour program. During your tour, the appropriate information will be automatically selected and displayed for you. Touch the area of the screen displaying the appropriate icon. Look, are we gonna hit that? Welcome to Jurassic Park. What have they got in there, King Kong? If you look to the right you'll see a herd of the first dinosaurs on our tour, called Dilophosaurus, one of the earliest carnivores. We now know Dilophosaurus is actually poisonous, spitting its venom at its prey, causing blindness and paralysis, allowing the carnivore to eat at its leisure. Alan? This makes Dilophosaurus Where? a beautiful but deadly addition to Jurassic Park. Vehicle headlights are on and not responding. Item 151 on today's glitch list. Dennis, our lives are in your hands and you have butterfingers? You think that kind of automation is easy? Or cheap? You know anybody who can network 8 machines and debug 2 million lines of code on my salary? Quiet all of you. They're approaching the Tyrannosaur paddock. We'll try to tempt the Rex now. Keep watching the fence. What's going to happen to the goat? He's going to eat the goat? Excellent. What's the matter kid? You never had lamb chops. I happen to be a vegetarian. Is it Triceratops? Don't be scared. It's okay. Modun tranquilized her for me. She is sick. What are her symptoms? Imbalance, disorientation, labored breathing. Is this West Indian lilac? Yes. We know they're toxic, but the animals don't eat them. There's only one way to be positive. I'd have to see the dinosaurus droppings. That storm hasn't dissipated or changed course. We're gonna have to cut the tour. Are you sure we have to? It's not worth taking the chance. I'd like to stay with Dr. Dot Harding and finish up with the trike. Sure. I'm in a gas-powered jeep. Alright everyone get back in the cars, a storm is approaching. Anybody want a soda or something? I should tell you the system will be compiling for 18 to 20 minutes. They might go on and off for a while but it's nothing to worry about. She's not available, is she? Why? I'm sorry, you two are? What did I touch? <sighs> Fences are failing all over the park. Find Nedry. Check the vending machines. Their radio's out too. Cool. Night vision. Did you feel that? Maybe it's the power trying to come back on. Where's the goat? He left us. Dr. Grant, I'm stuck. The seat's got my feet. I'll get you next, Tim. Don't move. He can't see us if we don't move. <laughs> he 
He's turning the safety systems off. Doesn't want anybody to see. Robert, I wonder if perhaps you would be good enough to take a gas jeep and bring back my grandchildren. Sure. I'm going with him. Should have been there by now. Damn it. I'll pull down this thing here and pull it back up again. Hello? I'm soaking wet. I don't have any food. I have nothing on me. You like the stick? Go on and get it. No wonder you're extinct. Alan? Dr. Grunt? I think this was Gennaro. I found Ian. He is alive. Anybody hear that? Come on. We've got to get out of here. Now. Right now. Must go faster. Let's get up this tree. Look at the Brachiosaurus. They're singing. Don't let the monsters come over here. They're not monsters, they're animals. They only eat vegetables. For you, I think they'd make an exception. We'll never find the command Nedra used. He's covered his tracks far too well. Shutting down the system is the only way to wipe out everything he did. We've never shut down the entire system before. It may not come back on. People are dying. Will you please shut down the system? Just like a flock of birds evading a predator, they're flocking this way. Wow, look how he attacks. Something's happened, something's wrong. He has not returned yet. I'm gonna go get the power back on. You can't just stroll down the road, I'm going with you. We can make it if we run. No, we can't, because we're being hunted. Run, towards the shed, I'm covering for you. I guess that means the power is off. Under the words contact position there's a round green button, push it. Him. No. <laughs> Clever girl. We are in the visitor's center. I'll be back soon. I promise. Just the two raptors, right? You sure the third one's contained? Yes, unless they figure out how to open doors. The velociraptors are inside. The control room, come. We've got to reboot the system first. Ellie the Raptors, help me with the door. Try to reach the gun. I can't get it unless I move. It's a Unix system. I know this. This might be the right file. All security systems are enabled. We got it. <laughs> 